If you added a few pounds during the pandemic, I know I have. It's jokingly called the COVID-15, like the freshman 15 when you head to college. But today we're going to start to reverse that extra weight. Dr. Derek Alessi joins us live. He's got a new book out called Cooking with Gold. We'll talk about that in a minute. But, Doc, for many people, gyms are closed. So what's the percentage of losing weight? And is it fitness or diet? It can be a combination of both, and it does depend on your age. When you're younger, you could get away with a little bit more. But if you're in your 30s, 40s, 50s or more, you have to be very conscious of doing both. I want to start with number one, though. When it comes to exercise, you want to make sure that you're doing the right exercise. All exercise is not equal, although it is good to be active. When you're doing exercise, you want to make sure that you're improving your metabolism. And the best way to do that is to do strength training. When you're lifting weights, it could be free weights, dumbbells, pulleys, even your own body weight. You are going to burn more calories 24 hours a day. And for a lot of people, it's really doing about three days per week. This does depend upon your level. But for a lot of people that I've worked with in the past, three days per week will improve their metabolism. And you don't even need that many fancy things. A lot of people are getting it done with home fitness equipment, even body weight exercises. You could start your metabolism revving up right now. All right, what about uh, different kinds of diets? You hear keto, paleo, uh, intermittent fasting even. What's key for most people? Diets are very popular. In fact, yes, you named all of the big ones. There are so many different names, Mediterranean, low-carb Atkins, and more. The key thing about diet, it's not a calorie game anymore. None of the popular diets are even talking about that. All of the different approaches that we just mentioned are trying to keep blood glucose and insulin low. And if you can do that by eating the right proteins, the right dietary fats, and lower sugar carbs, you can eat a lot of foods, delicious foods, and get in great shape. And I can't stress this enough, it is not a calorie game as much as it is an insulin game. And then furthermore, when it comes to insulin, not only can you lose body fat, but get this, you could also improve your immune system, which of course is top of mind for so many people right now. It really is. All right, now let's talk about your new book. It's called Cooking with Gold, and it's free. So tell me a little bit about the book and where people can get it. Yeah, cooking with gold. In fact, that is liquid gold, and liquid gold is Australian macadamia nut oil. For those of you who have cooked with it before, you know exactly what I'm talking about. If you haven't cooked with it before, if you've never heard of it before, you are in for a treat. Australian macadamia nut oil is considered the new olive oil. It tastes like butter, holds up to a higher temperature point, but at the same time is even healthier than olive oil. So when it comes to putting foods together, and we just mentioned a lot of popular diets, people want to know exactly how that looks in terms of actual foods and recipes. So my book, which is Cooking with Gold, is available on strengthgenesis.com, as you mentioned, for free. In fact, I want to give it to people so you can see exactly how you should be eating for your breakfast, for your lunch, for your dinner, for your sides, for your snacks, so you can lose weight, drop body fat, and improve your health right now at strengthgenesis.com. Take a look at it, go through your day, and if you do that, you will feel better, look better, and start dropping body fat. Dr. Derek Alessi, thanks so much for joining us this morning. We appreciate it. Some good tips to lose that COVID-15. Thank you, sir.